It occurred to me after watching Nativity Rocks, the fourth Nativity film, that I've never actually discussed Nativity 2, so I thought I'd revisit it and see if my opinions are still the same. And yeah, they are. I'm a big fan of the Nativity film series in general. Just to kind of sum up, the first film is amazing. This second film is pretty good, and I will of course discuss that in more detail. The third film, even though I love the cast, probably shouldn't have existed. But the fourth film is actually quite refreshing with a really great character and a really nice sentimental message, even though I think they got some of the film a little wrong. But Nativity 2, Danger in the Manger, obviously David Tennant being one of my favourite people in the world, I was always going to like at least aspects of this. This was released in 2012, directed and written by Debbie Izzett, who has been at the helm of all of the Nativity films. And we are back to St Bernadette's and Mr Poppy is taking the children to the National um, Song for Christmas competition. Obviously they had a success the previous year, previous year with a brilliant Christmas show. Now they're going on the road and um, taking the children to a competition. This takes things up a notch because the children are going to be out of their comfort zone. They're going to be in a completely different environment. With things always going wrong in rehearsals, will they ever actually be prepared in time? And once they are ready, will they get to the destination in time? That is the big question. There are all kinds of obstacles that get in their way. And I think Mr. Poppy handles these situations very well, very entertainingly. I think Mr. Poppy as a character is just brilliant. You know, Mark Wooten is... Nobody else could have played Mr. Poppy like Mark Wooten. I think he was made for this role and he is exactly the kind of teacher that children want. Maybe the parents of the children don't want that kind of teacher, but the children definitely do. David Tennant playing this teacher, I, abs I love him. I absolutely love him. He's brilliant and he really made this film for me. A little biased since I'm obsessed. But the rest of the cast is brilliant as well. Jason Watkins, of course, is back as Gordon Shakespeare. We have Joanna Page, Jessica Hines, Pam Ferris, who is obviously amazing, Ian McNeese. I can't fault the cast. For me, the cast, even when the narrative is maybe not as strong, the cast always keeps it going. Once they kind of hit the road, that's when I lost a little bit of interest and I think the narrative became a little bit too predictable. For me, the fun is in the performances of the children, watching them sing and dance and have a good time and be free spirits. That's what I find enjoyable about these films. And I feel like it became just a little bit too, not serious, but a little bit too dry when they're on the road or heading to the destination. It picks back up again a little bit towards the end and ultimately left me with a positive feeling about the film. It is not as good as the first film. The performances are as good as the first film, by which I mean they're as entertaining. But I feel like there, there are fewer of them. I would have liked more of an abundance of them. But given the, the nature of the narrative, I can see kind of why that happened. Um, we can't really have children doing performances while they're heading to this destination. It would be a bit bizarre and unbelievable. So they've kept it a bit more realistic. It's, it's a decent enough narrative. I like it enough. I think they took the first film and put it in a different situation to carry on the formula in a new way. By the time we get to the third film, things get a little bit repetitive. The fourth film, yeah, repetitive in parts, but the character of Doru makes things really interesting for the fourth film. But Nativity 2, still pretty fresh at this stage, still really loving Mr. Poppy, a lot of things to love in this film. It's not perfect, it's not as good as the first film, but Nativity 2 is by no means a bad film.